And welcome back. His name is synonymous with Branson, entertaining people for decades with his showmanship. And now he is opening his new season in a more intimate setting. Guess who is back on stage in Branson? Well, these two are Shoji and Christina. The Tabuchi. Hey, it is so good to see you. Tell people where we are right now because you've been gone for a little bit. We have we, been. We have been. But we are at the IMAX Theater on stage at the Little Opry Theater. Yes. In Branson. Yes, yes. How does how does that feel? Because I mean, you know, with everything oh. that went on, you've had to pull kind of pull back a little. Bit. I want you to know it. It just uh, uh, everything just. Uh, I'm I'm so excited because I was itching to perform. Sure. sure and sure. but the, this COVID things, you know, it, it uh, hit me very close to. Uh, to me because uh, I lost my brother mm -hmm. in Japan. Mm -hmm. and, and, and after that, we, we, we had to have to make a decision. Yes. And we decided to take a uh, little break. And break. now we are excited more than ever to get back on stage. Yeah. And we've got the band, we've got the singers, we've got the costumes. For the and band. Okay, yeah, go. let's talk a little bit about that because, you know, you. The one thing I remember when I worked with Shoji is that you like those intimate kind of settings. You like kind of a jam session kind of feel. We do. And I, I know do. you're going, yeah, and I know you're going for that, but that doesn't mean you've scaled things back. You still have a band here. Absolutely. We still have the band, as I said, and we bought we brought some set pieces, uh, a few set pieces in with us, and of course his fantastic and jackets. They'll be oh, they'll yeah. be here, of uh, that's, course. That's Can't do the show without the jackets mm -hmm. now. Mm -hmm. And uh, the performers, so yeah. How's this feel to you? Because this is gonna be like a, a new opening for you. Oh I, I I'm so excited. Uh-huh. And I'm so glad Christina jumped in and helping me. Okay, what can what can people expect? Because I know, you know, if, if I'm shutting my eyes and I'm picturing Shoji, I know what I what I'm thinking about. A lot of people are the same. Right. What can people expect here on the stage? Well, I will be doing uh, the first part of the show, and that covers all kinds of music from, uh, you know, your classic country to. Uh, Tina Turner. I mean, it's just yeah. a, it's all of it. And then when dad starts with his, it's the story that he's been wanting to do for a very long time is start in Japan, coming to the U.S. and then his journey along the way and kind of t to where we are now and, and tell that story. This is going to be great because it's going to be like a whole thing of Shoji Speaks. I mean, you're going to be able to tell your story. Right. right. Uh, with, with the music too. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah, how, how it started in the seven years old on the Suzuki method. Yeah. You, you know. I oh, mean, yes. You, you sure I do. But it's like people think that you just kind of sprung out of the earth in this huge theater with the fancy jackets. There's a lot. You're not exactly an overnight <laughs> sensation. No. no. Yeah. The, 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 a lot, lot of work, a lot of time, and a lot of work. <laughs> Lots of mileage. <laughs> well, yeah, thank goodness, thank goodness, because obviously you went in the right direction. And and that's something I know that, you know, the intimacy of this theater is something you really enjoy as well. Yes. I, I used to come here on the gym too, so. Mm -hmm. the church service. So it's a little bit of a homecoming for you as well. There's got to be a lot of challenge, you know, going from that huge stage to kind of, you know, scoping things down. but. That's what You're I do. That's what I do. That's what I've been raised to do. And so yeah. that's, we make it happen and it's going to be great. We really are excited. Mm -hmm. All right. Tell, tell the folks when they're going to be able to see you here at the IMAX. Starting day is April the 21st. Coming up real quick. All right. You're here Wednesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays, yes. correct? Right. Yes. How do people keep track of Shoji? Because that's something, what's Shoji doing? You can tell them how to do that. We have Shoji.com and LittleOpry.com as far as scheduling and tickets. Mm -hmm. And then we also have both of our uh, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, all social media, everything. So you S can find us. S-H-O-J-I. 
Cho G. Cho G. Thank you. That's yes. Right. Thank you. Yes. That's Cho one G. of the first things I heard. <laughs> it is so good both you seeing both of you and, and much you. success. Nice. You know Thank on the, on the, the the you know the new digs. This is going to be a lot of fun. Come and see Shoji and Christina. It's going to be a great show. I know it. It's good to see him again. It see is. them both again. Isn't oh, it? yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. I worked for him about 27 years mm -hmm. ago and just one of the most generous people you will ever meet in your life. Just a very nice man. And what a talent. And his daughter and his wife, Dorothy, mm -hmm. she, she produces all of those huge extravaganzas. Three, three, three real powerhouses right there in Branson. Oh, no doubt. And it's all starting around, what did he say, the 21st? 21st. 21st. That is great to see. You should definitely see him if you have not. So. Uh, oh, absolutely. Uh, uh, you know, I have to admit, when I first went there, my thought was, how is a fiddle player going to entertain me for the next two hours? And boy, do you find out. <laughs> that man can play. Yeah, he's legendary in yeah, Branson. Absolutely. Love to see people who love to stay there and keep entertaining people. Mm -hmm. Absolutely adore it.